Hi, this is Chris with FRN. You may know me from the podcast or my artwork or Whataburger, but uh, <laughs> I'm an idiot. I'm sorry. Um, here's the story of what we got today. You, first off, you don't see us doing a lot of videos. The reason for that is one, I'm lazy. Two, I have a million deadlines. And three, I always forget to make them anyway. So Aaron, I'm sorry, but here's a video for our content. This is the brand new Lego minifigs that came out recently. Uh, they are mystery bags, and they're really cool. And apparently they came out today, super hard to find. I was out running errands today and found a person who had found one and asked her if there were any more, she said no. So I was on a video call with my wife. Say hi, wife. Hi, wife. And she says, well, let me check and see if Kohl's has any. And so she gets on the website and the website says they have plenty. So I book it over there, get some customer service from over there. And here we are, uh, probably not a complete box, but I bought every last one that was in the box. And so we're gonna do an unboxing for you guys. Why do we love the Muppets? Because the Muppets are awesome. The Muppets are awesome. And my wife feels like there's a drastic misrepresentation of them in the Disney parks. Cause there is. <laughs> so we're gonna start with the first one. So here we go. Watch the defunct land on Jim Henson and the Muppets. You'll know why. <laughs> All right. This is one of the old men. I'm not sure if it's Statler or Waldorf, but it's one of them. He's got a laptop. Which one was the laptop, dear? I don't know. Oh, okay. He's so cool. I literally have to put the laptop together. Really? Yeah. It's, Why it's, does he have a laptop? I don't know. When have the old men ever have a, had a laptop? Um, I didn't watch The Office Muppets. That's probably where it came from, I would assume. Alright, so either Stadler or Waldorf. I can't remember which one. Is it showing up really good on the video? Eh. Uh, okay. We'll, uh, I'll tell you what we'll do is we'll insert some uh, beauty shots in the uh, in the video. So. I was going to turn the lighting down. Was it too bright? Well, nah. Okay. We'll fix it in post. <laughs> oh, yeah, buddy. Get out of there. Swedish chef. He's awesome. I've, and I feel like I had to buy the whole dang box of them because if I didn't, once word got out that they were hitting the streets, they'd be gone and we'd be out of luck. There so. are 12 in the whole set. Yes. Do you, do, should I go over the video or should I go over the little booklet or should we just surprise ourselves as we go along? We can here? surprise ourselves as we go along because if we get them all, then they will all know we, what the ones are. Fair enough. Is this a turnip or a beet? It's usually a, a turnip. Oh, okay, sweet. And he comes, yeah, so the Swedish chef here comes with his uh, his whisk, which is really cool. <laughs> oh my god! And he comes with a little uh, little uh, beat, I think, or something. I don't know if you guys can see that. Super dope. Again, we're going to put some glamour shots in here at the end. Oh, back them up because they can't see them. They're oh, okay, hold on. Good. Good there? Mm-hmm. Okay. I got a face made for radio, so I'm sorry if uh, what were your phones. Let's see. Uh oh, you'll be happy about this deer. Gonzo. Gonzo. Hello. Yeah, buddy. Gonzo the Great. Gonzo is great. Gonzo the Great. He's so cool. These things. I'm, I'm promising you. Like, I would be shocked if I see these sticking around on shelves as much as people love the Muppets and as timeless as they are as characters once even like even if you don't know these are hitting shelves like once people are walking around the toy the toy sections and they see these out there they're going to buy them hey trivia time yes what's the name of Gonzo's chicken girlfriend who oh, is that man. crap is it Claudette nope Bertha nope Antoinette Camilla. Camilla, that's right. Camilla Parker Bowles, like the uh, the royal uh, house well, homewrecker. 
she was Camilla in the first Muppet movie, so she predates. <laughs> she pre she pre predates Camilla Parker Bowles. Yeah. She predates um Prince Harry and, and Prince William too. For the record, I don't pay any attention to the royals, but my wife does. That's why I know that name. Hey, we got Fozzie. Fozzie, Walka Walka. We don't have any doubles yet. No, we are sans doubles at the moment, which is good. Oh, did you want to show um, everybody after you build Fozzie the one that you got because we were excited about him? Yeah, so <laughs> I, whenever I got home from uh, running my errands, uh, I wanted to open one because I was fiending to do so. And we uh, end up getting uh, Bunsen, right? Bunsen Honeydew. Bunsen Honeydew. So he's, he was actually the first one we opened. And he comes with a beaker, but beaker doesn't come with a beaker. Which is odd, but kind of funny. That's, it is the uh, Muppets after all. Why does he have two microphones? I'm not sure I understand. Yeah, I guess in case you um, lose one. Oh, cause my Spice Girl came with two microphones. So oh. I'll put it with the extra. Okay, strange. Yes, right. I have Lego Spice Girls. Yes, she does. I need to finish the other three. Let me give you guys a shot of that. So it's Fozzie. Waka waka. And he's got the, he's got a banana and a microphone there to tell jokes with extra microphone for some reason. Well, I feel like there was like a little thing about this in the, in the little paperwork it comes with. I feel like there was a thing about this microphone. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. For whatever reason, he just comes with the extra microphone parts. All right. Next. So far, yes, yeah, no doubles. Although we're going to change ourselves. I mean, there's more than 12 packages here. I think there's 12 figures, right? Yeah. So we're bound to hit a double at some point. And our first double. Who is it? Bunsen. Bunsen. So we don't have to really build him, but we can do it. No, no, you're right. I can just set it to the side. We can worry about that afterwards. I, I would venture to say our doubles are end up going to friends or family or uh, the next toy show we go to. Oh my god, oh, about the part. No. Why would you do that? I, I would ask you to get it for me, dear, but I know you're indisposed. I, instead, <laughs> will grab it for you. Where did it go? It's right here. So now, who is it? Oh, I think it's Animal, because I think that's his drum set. You are 100% correct, dear. It is most certainly in so this set only has two members of Electric Mayhem. Um, it has Janice and uh, Animal, which I think is lame, because I want Dr. Teeth. <laughs> <laughs> I want the whole band. <laughs> drum. He has drumsticks. Yeah, the whole drum set that he gets. Oh my God. Okay. Animal's the dopest one. I think he's got special instructions as well. Probably. Yes, he does, okay. So, those of you who are watching who haven't been to a Disney park or Walt Disney World, Hollywood Studios in particular, Drops. you're missing out because there is a, uh, was it Muppet 3D? Muppet Vision Muppet 3D. Vision, yeah, Muppet Vision 3D. It is super awesome. And I agree with my wife. There is a gross misrepresentation. Because they did close the Muppet store which only had one corner of Muppets in the Muppet store. The rest was Star Wars, so I have a bone to pick with um, George Lucas. <laughs> yeah, I'll have his people call your people, y'all can do lunch. They added one Muppet thing, and I had just okay barbecue just for the fact that it was Sam Eagle's barbecue joint. <laughs> You know, I don't remember it being terrible or anything. It wasn't terrible, but I mean, we live in Texas and it's barbecue. Uh, that's true. And then they got rid of this, what, like a month before my first visit? They used to have in Liberty Square where Haunted Mansion is, um, the Muppets retelling the story of America um, in the Magic Kingdom and they got rid of that and I was mad. So the only way Disney can buy me back as if they do an overlay of Muppets Haunted Mansion <laughs> for Halloween. Yeah, she's saying she'll never go back to Disney Park ever again. That's a lie. <laughs> Don't I know it. I think I made that right. Yeah, I guess so. It's a little drum contraption. Pretty cool. All right. 
drumsticks. And I'll do the drumstick later. But little drumsticks are like if you're familiar with the Harry Potter Lego figs, they have uh, drumsticks, which are basically wands. Okay. Wait, set it up? What? Probably, it'd be, it would probably be better served to have another little base on it. We might have extras in our extra Legos. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Okay. All right, next. I know this is riveting stuff, this video. This is why this is why you do a ton of videos for FRM. Because I'm just uh, a cult of personality, if you will. <laughs> oh, okay, there's another double. It's a double Gonzo. So you have a double Gonzo and a double Bunsen. No Kermit, no Miss Piggy yet. Or a beaker. Or a beaker. We need beakers so we can have both of them. And we have one old man, not both old men. Yeah. Is that another Bunsen? It is another Bunsen. Ah, all right. We have another Bunsen. And we need Janice too. Man, a lot of these come in sets. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. There's some Lego nerd that was filling every bag before we got there to see which ones had which in them. I think this is the other old man. This is Statler and Waldorf. Yeah, we have both the old men now. Yay! Sweet! The fun thing about uh, Muppet Vision 3D is some of the Muppets are actually there. So, like, you're sitting in a theater and they are in their box. So, they're not on the screen in the movie. They're actually in their box. That is true. And then the, the Penguin Orchestra from the, the Muppet Show, they're there. Sweetums runs out, so you actually get to see Sweetums, but it's bull crap that you don't get to do a meet and greet with him. And then uh, the bunny, the bunny who you only see in Muppet Babies <laughs> <laughs> and that Muppet Vision Dream. So this old man has uh, his uh, coffee, I guess. I guess. His coffee cups. And he has a sign, because he's a troll. He has a sign that has a bunch of Z's on it. Okay, well then, I'll show you that. <laughs> so that's cool. We got both the old guys. Love that. Love that for us. Yes. Oh, so more. Okay, good. I'll, I'll take, wait a minute. Alright. Is another old man? As we say, is that another Bunsen? It's the old man we just opened. We have double old man and double Bunsen. Triple Bunsen, actually. Come on, Kermit. <laughs> Who are you? I can't tell. Oh, is it the other old man? <laughs> God dang it, we have a double, a complete double of Statler and Waldorf. Honestly, if you haven't even checked to see what the aftermarket does on these, we might just put these on eBay for a long time. Another old man? <laughs> Dang it. All right. This might be a shorter video than we banked on. <laughs> what the heck are you? <laughs> I don't know what this is. That is Rolf. Oh, it's Rolf. Oh, okay, okay, cool. Then there we go. He has a bust of Beethoven with this. That's what I was seeing, yeah. I was seeing the little white head. And I was like, what the heck is that? Well, good. I like Rolf. <laughs> the bust of Beethoven is basically a Doc Brown head with a hair. This is <laughs> Doc Brown from uh, Back to the Future. Can you picture that? <laughs> We need Kermit and... We need Kermit, Piggy, Janice, Beaker, at least. Right? But Rolf is awesome. Rolf is awesome. Oh, Rolf. Here comes a little sheet, a uh, little thing of sheet music. Pretty cool. Immortalized and such. Right. 
Hey! Hey! We have Miss Piggy. Yay! I have two Miss Piggies on my desk at work, so maybe she'll go to work with me. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> My wife had this idea she's going to make a display like the old Muppet Show uh, marquee. It's time to play the music. It's time to light the lights. It's time to get things started on the Muppet, Muppet Show tonight. tonight. Shh, boom, 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 boom. This is so cool. And she's so vain. She probably thinks this song is about her. So yeah. Little Miss Piggy comes with a magazine with her face on it. Pretty cool. Get you a look at her without the magazine. Piggy! Okay, so we said there's it? a grand total of 12 in the set, right? Yeah. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We're missing three. So we're missing Kermit, uh, Janice, and Beaker. And Beaker. So slide in my DMs if you have them. Let's uh, let's talk turkey because we have some extras, uh, Bunsen, some old men, and a Gonzo, I think. We have a whole complete old men set. Statler and Waldorf, yeah. Although once your mom finds out we have these, she probably wants Statler and Waldorf. <laughs> probably. Yeah. She likes Gonzo. Oh, well, we have an extra Gonzo. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I have been Chris. This has been my lovely wife off camera. Uh, we are excited to offer up a little bit more than me just talking mess on a podcast so again hope you guys enjoy we'll drop some of these photos in the video um be sure to follow us on facebook instagram uh i think we have a twitter i don't know oh okay yeah anyway we will see you guys soon thanks